Hey everyone, Matt Tursik, Seth Murphy. We're here, it's Tuesday, and we are touring a brand new construction listing by John DaCosta of Keller Williams. This is Westland Custom Homes, a former Street of Dreams builder, coming to Lake Oswego with this fantastic new build. Seth's got the stats, and we're gonna show you what's up. Yeah, it's four bed, four and a half bath. It's sitting on a 0.4 acre lot, and it is 4,340 square feet. That's a lot of fours. Let's go inside and we'll show you everything about this house. A couple things we want to point out are all the natural stone you have on the facade of this house. It really gives it a nice rich look. I love the glass garage doors and they used real cedar siding. So it's a beautiful color combination with a low roof pitch profile and a huge driveway. And at the entry of the home, you have this digital lock, the fogged glass door, and this wonderful tongue and groove cedar ceiling treatment. Okay, so stepping in immediately, you have an office space or actually a full bed. There is a full bath right next to it off your entry. And then you come down this nice long hallway corridor where you have plenty of room for mirrors, art, beautiful gallery walls, a lot of natural light here, and it opens up to the kitchen on the left. Okay, so really interesting layout here, the way the dining room joins to this kitchen. You have a nice size island with quartz counters, stainless steel appliances. It's probably a 60 inch Thermador range. I love how it has the dual oven action with the pot filler up above. Nice painted cabinet uh, refrigerator right here that's tucked in, blends nicely. Yeah, and I'm a, I'm a big fan of all the little details they had in here, all the under cab lights. I'm a real big fan of how they took the cabinets all the way to the ceiling, the matte black hardware along all of the cabinets, the color tones in here are just really light, fresh. And then you have a nice outlook to your deck in a wonderfully sized pantry. And then over here, you have this nice area. So if you're having a big family dinner or maybe like a party, extra area to put some snacks, desserts, anything like that. You have a beverage cooler over here. So you could also treat it as a, you know, a mini bar top. Plenty of cabinets for all of your little nickety knacks and even two cabinets for cookie trays. And then tucked away over around the corner, you have the great room, beautiful ceiling fan, box ceilings here, nice big floor to ceiling windows. I love the black trim on the windows. And beautiful, huge natural stone facade, fireplace setup. You got the room for the TV up top, beautiful black linear gas fireplace with a little peekaboo out to the deck. All right, now we're out on the deck. I love this spacious area. You have room for your barbecue over there. I love what they did with the hand railing, overlooks your spacious backyard, all the greenery, little water feature over here. They had the tongue and groove cedar ceiling finish that they had at the front of the house back here. Big fan. Okay, so we've just wrapped up the upstairs outdoor area. The floor plan is actually a really nice layout and that you have the master suite over here overlooking the deck. And then you have two bedrooms that share a Jack and Jill bathroom situation over here. So you actually have three full bedrooms all on the main floor with a huge three car garage. Very rare in Lake Oswego these days and it's all been plumbed for the central vac system as well as one feature I love on the house that makes it feel very rich are these nice tall eight foot doors. Yeah, now here we are in the master bedroom. Great size master bedroom, again, with the outlook to the territorial views. You also have access to the deck. And Matt, I love the light fixture. So immediately stepping into here, love these windows, again, floor to ceiling with a tile going all the way up. Freestanding tub immediately as you enter on your right with a double vanity, beautiful glass shower, and huge closet. Love that. All right, now we're gonna head downstairs with some extra living. I love what they did with these windows all along the ceiling to bring in more natural light, and then another window at the bottom of the stairs. Okay, so coming down into this basement area, you can tell it was really designed for entertaining. A lot of different spaces in here, including my favorite, the bar setup. This thing's huge, it's basically like a second kitchen in the house. And then you've got TV area over there or over there, depending on how you wanna set up the space. Dual sliding doors out to a huge covered living area with a linear gas fireplace. In addition to two extra storage spaces down here, they also have a bedroom with its own full bathroom, which rounds out the four bedrooms Okay, so that wraps up this week's Tuesday tour. Thank you for tuning in. This is a fantastic new listing, $2.195 million, and one of the only new construction homes in Lake Oswego. Let us know if you have any more questions, and if not, we will see you guys next Tuesday. And that wraps up this week's tour.